Benny. I'm from Norway. I'm a musician. I make uh, soundscapes. So you might call me a soundscapist. I also work with the ancient kinds of music, uh, tracing the roots of music, using the instruments of, of the mother, Mother Earth. Uh, I have, for the last quite a few years, been very interested in this because of the power that is within them, the healing powers that come through everything that is in nature. And uh, my reason for coming here is I was here one year, one year ago at the uh, one week overtone singing course and started working with the energies in the way they teach here. And I felt it's very important for me at this point on my journey to come back here and learn more about how to consciously work with the energies. And in recent years, I have decided I would like to move away from the food business and more towards healing. And sound was the most likely thing to go with meditation uh, for me. Um, so I, I came here basically to explore the world of sound. And uh, I find it quite amazing. Uh, the journey has been quite deep very, very profound, and to quantify the last two weeks is very difficult for me at this time, but I know a lot has happened, and um, I really look forward to going home, uh, back to Ireland, and uh, just seeing how things unfold from here, where I go with the sound. Um, there are many, uh, we, we worked with Tibetan bowls, we worked with tuning forks, we worked with colour and also with a voice doing overtoning and work to free the voice as well. Uh, so I feel uh, this work has really changed me somehow. There is a lot of focus on the balancing and I believe that balance is one of the most important issues we have at this moment in time. The world is in a very interesting state, so to speak. So I think also the relatively enormous focus on balance I really appreciate. And also the whole course in essence, it's not really about learning from Michel and Nestor as some kind of, you know, masters or something. It's more about learning techniques they have worked on a long time and integrating them within ourselves. So it's also a lot about finding, you know, real pure confidence in ourselves. I would say that the most amazing thing uh, for me on this course was working with the voice. Uh, I feel I found my, vo found my voice. Uh, you know, the, the exercises we did with the overtoning and the singing, uh, we, did, we sang every day, we toned every day. Um, it just really freed the voice and somehow in freeing the voice, uh, I feel that I, I got to know myself more. Um, I think Michelle and Nestor are excellent teachers. They are very clear on the fact that they are not here as our gurus. They are here to share, share their knowledge that they have gained through many years of conscious work with sound and frequency. They are also very clear on the intention of us learning from them and integrating it in ourselves and they are also very open about themselves also being in processes and learning. And this I admire in teachers. The way that Nestor and Michelle uh, held the space for all of us uh, was really amazing. Uh, it was a very nurturing environment. Um, 
So in that way, that, that holding that they both did really helped us all to, to grow and develop ourselves. I'm traveling home with a lot more self-confidence regarding the subject of working with sound and frequency than I had. I am much more conscious about my abilities to work with these tools. And I have also seen, this is not new to me, because I've always known that sound has an enormous effect on us, but I have also seen during this, this course, being here with so many different people, I have also seen that, yes, it really does work. This course has been a wonderful journey. I cannot say. Really, actually, there aren't really enough words to describe it because uh, the experience was that profound, really. It's very, very difficult to quantify, you know, what I received on this course. I would just say, go for it. You won't regret it. <laughs>